Not even a couple months ago, Pussycat Dolls lead singer Nicole Scherzinger was spotted house hunting in LA with her athlete boyfriend Tom Evans. But this didn't come as much of a surprise considering the pop star put her contemporary Sunset Strip home on the market around the same time. Currently, Nicole still lives in this house which she showed off to Architectural Digest in the past. While her and her men haven't settled on a new spot yet, today we'll take a look at a few of the places she's called home both past and present. We even found the listings. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Nicole Scherzinger is a singer and TV personality born in Honolulu, Hawaii and raised in Louisville, Kentucky. She started off performing in plays when she was young and later dropped out of university to pursue a musical career with rock band Days of the New. Nicole found a bit of success in 2001 when she won a spot in Eden's Crush, a girl group created through the reality show Pop Stars. When Nicole finally became the lead singer of the Pussycat Dolls, releasing albums in 2005 and 2008, this was when she really hit it big. PCD was one of the world's best selling girl groups of all time, but Nicole's leading role caused some friction and the band eventually went their separate ways. While Nicole's solo music career has been a bit of a struggle, she ventured onto TV winning Dancing with the Stars and serving as a judge on numerous shows from The X Factor UK to The Masked Singer, which is also her current gig and more. She's also appeared in a couple movies like the musical cast. Throughout her career, Nicole has sold over 16 million records as an artist and more than 54 million with the Pussycat Dolls. Her other ventures included clothing lines, a perfume, and she's also an ambassador for the Special Olympics. Nicole's current estimated net worth is thought to be around 14 to 16 million dollars. Hey guys, it's Kara, and today we're bringing you another house tour here in Famous Entertainment. We're noticing 95% of you watching aren't subscribed, so hit that subscribe button and ring that bell. We post a new video daily. Today we're checking out where Pussycat Dolls lead singer Nicole Scherzinger calls home, like her multi-level modern estate above the Sunset Strip, her former Hawaii house, and more. We've also done house tours and celebrities like Celine Dion and more, and we'll link to some at the end. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram to chat, and as usual, let me know whose house tour is next in those comments down below. Below. Now let's get into this video. Back in 2014, we were able to get a peek at Nicole's former Hollywood Hills home because she put it up for sale at around $2.3 million. The songstress bought the home in 2006 from Daisy Fuentes for $2.16 million and lived there for a handful of years. This estate up in the hills sat on a 1.5 acre knoll and had no immediate neighbors, perfect for a celeb desiring some privacy. Nicole's former home was built in a Mediterranean style, spanning just over 4,000 square feet with four beds and three baths. The home was cozy but still had a Hollywood feel to it, offering expansive views from most every room, and the neighborhood it was situated in was star-studded. Inside Nicole's former abode, there were spaces like a two-story living room with soaring ceilings, and nearby a spacious dining room perfect for entertaining. There were three gas and wood-burning fireplaces throughout, taking the cozy vibes up a notch. In the gourmet eating kitchen, you'll find granite counters, stainless appliances, and since it's combined with the great room, there's a ton of space to host or just hang out. The generous-sized master suite Nicole previously occupied featured a massive closet, ample storage as well as a stunning marble ensuite with separate stall shower. Guest bedrooms were located upstairs and one offered an expansive outdoor terrace. Downstairs you'll find an additional bedroom that could also be used as an office. Outside there were many outdoor living spaces and while there wasn't a swimming pool at the time, with all the room on the grounds one could easily be added. In 2018, it was reported that Nicole let go of a plantation style property she owned in her homeland of Hawaii, more specifically in the area of Walane on 1.25 acres of land. While she listed the lavish home for $1.399 million, she was happy to accept a lower price for it. And it comes with stunning ocean and mountain views all over. The 3,460 75 square foot villa was built in 2014 and served as an ideal location for Nicole to have a getaway. The tropical landscape surrounds the home on three sides and her property had its own vegetation which added a pop of color to the glamorous house. Inside there were four beds, 4.5 luxury bathrooms, and her former master suite was complete with floral themed upholstery, wooden furniture, and even its own spiral staircase. Nicole's bedroom led to a grand ensuite bath, which had a large walk-in shower and tub fitted with marble tiles for a glamorous finish. The home was the perfect spot for entertaining friends and family, considering there were three guest bedrooms throughout as well. The common living spaces were spacious, including a main family room brightened up by huge windows and a built 
built-in fireplace. Alongside the living rooms, Nicole's Hawaii home had an open-plan kitchen, complete with center island and separate dining table for plenty of guests. And if the tropical location of the property isn't enough, there's of course a cabana and swimming pool lined by sun loungers to really soak in the resort-like feel. Here you're surrounded by ferns, palm trees, and other native plants. This sun-drenched terrace overlooks the ocean and has a built-in barbecue, while the backdrop shows off the island's volcanic landscape. While Nicole's Hawaii property was truly breathtaking, she let go of it after she was done as a judge on The X Factor. Last, but certainly not least, Nicole's current home. While we know she's house hunting with her man at the moment, she didn't buy anything just yet, so she's still living in this place, and it's on the market for $7.5 million. Nicole showed off this place for Architectural Digest back in 2019, and the sunny contemporary home sends 4,602 square feet inside with four beds and four baths. It seems that the singer loves a home with both modern and cozy vibes which we saw in her former Hollywood house and can notice in some of the rooms here. The glass-walled multi-level home has jetliner views that stretch from the downtown skyline to the ocean and it's set high above LA's Sunset Strip on a high ridge. While Nicole originally bought the home for only 3.75 million over four years ago and is seeking to turn a profit on the sale, she made a number of significant changes and upgrades since she moved in. Likely the biggest one was knocking down a main level wall to allow for full views via floor to ceiling windows in the dining room. The open plan on the main level offers a sleek kitchen that revolves around a custom built marble top center island and marble and wood throughout. The den is tucked away on the same floor, which is one of Nicole's favorite rooms because it's so cozy and it has a white fireplace and more picture perfect views. There's also a roomy dining area with full walls of glass that slide open to a slim terrace. There are a couple of bedrooms on the lower level, one that was turned into a gym and the other has two sets of bunk beds to sleep a few guests. Nicole's celeb style master suite takes a premium position on the penthouse floor with a cozy nook just outside that keeps her grand piano. The suite is glamorous with a black marble fireplace and a sitting area that spills out to a private terrace, while the contemporary ensuite opens to a second terrace and custom designed walk-in closet. Nicole's home also boasts a home theater with plush sofa beds and lights built into the carpeted stairs. Not to mention, elsewhere, there's an indoor-outdoor area with a big screen TV for outdoor movies, a wet bar, a small saltwater pool, and a swing that pushes over the pool and looks down at the city below. Alright, so I think I'm going to bring this house tour to an end here. We've taken a look at the homes of Pussycat Doll lead singer Nicole Scherzinger, including her former Hollywood house, Hawaii Getaway, and her current hilltop property in LA. So the question is, which of the three was your favorite? I think mine was her current home because it's the perfect mix of cozy and contemporary. In some spaces, there were double height ceilings and full glass walls, and other rooms were warm and modestly sized. Sometimes you just want to feel cozy inside your home. Be sure to tell me which of Nicole's homes was your fave or rate them in the comments down below. Also, I heard the Pussycat Dolls are going to be back together for a tour. I wonder when that's scheduled to happen, but I'm here for it. I'm trying to get 1,000 subs on my personal channel and I'm almost there, so if you haven't subscribed, please go do so. We'll link you my latest vlog. Here you can get to know me a bit better and see what my home life is like. She was twerking on it just like a minute ago. <laughs> but it's hey, I wanted these. Thanks for watching guys. I'm still reading all of your comments and amazing suggestions. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and tell me whose house tours you guys want to see. I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.